Alrighty guys, we are back with the WWE 2K22 GM mode. Been a while since we played this, need to refresh the memory. What the fuck is happening? Apparently the show is already booked, so we're ready to get into it. And I've seen that Tony Storm is cutting a self-promo, and I just can't help think to myself that Tony Storm sounds like such a porn name, doesn't it? Tony Storm. Tony Storm does porn. It even rhymes, man. That has to be a porn name. But yeah, we're giving her a chance to cut a promo. Um, yeah, you need to put the mic next to your mouth, but don't be putting it in your mouth. That's important. Uh, it's a wee important tip for you there. But we're going to be kicking off the show with the beast, Bobby Lashley, the fucking destroyer. Well, hopefully he destroys Damien Priest, because look at that guy dressed there like a gimp, man. We have to defeat him. So come on, Bobby Lashley. It's important that you win this match. I can't remember why it's important, but... I need Bobby Lashley to win this. Yeah, that's what I'm going with. Uh, we've got Montez Ford and Seth Rollins. We've got, we've got Riddle calling it Montez. Uh, we've got Riddle calling it Seth. I need to... I fucking don't have a clue. What's happening here? Been a, legit been a bit of mum since I played this. By the way, uh, the show is coming to you from Buffalo, New York, if anybody cares. If anybody's a Buffalo fan or a New York fan. I like Buffalo Wings. Buffalo Wings are pretty good, but... Anyway, who cares? We've got Riddle calling it Seth freaking Rollins. And in the main event, this is the match we're going to be playing. Look at this. Jesus Christ. Brock Lesnar and Goldberg. Wow. Taking on Samoa Joe and Randy Orton. Speaking of buffalo wings, looks like Samoa Joe's been eating a lot of buffalo wings. I think you need to cut down there, mate. Go to go for the Subway salad next time, you fat bastard. But anyway, here we go. Let's get into it. Let's quickly check the ratings. Are we... We're almost catching SmackDown. We're not doing that. We're not, no, we're not. No, oh, fuck me. I'm talking shit. My mail's behind. We were a lot closer, but for some reason, we've the gap's actually got bigger. Right, I'm, that's it. I'm never going about a month without playing this again because I honestly cannot remember what's been happening. Um, ensure that you'll retain most of your fans this week. I don't think we need that. I think we'll, I think that show we're doing looks pretty good. I think we'll keep most of our fans anyway. I'm not going to use this. What's this? Um, two extreme, one randomly booked extreme rules match on your show will receive a higher than normal rating. I uh, don't think we've got extreme rules booked, do we? I don't think we do. But I tell you what, we could make this Extreme Rules. But then it's going to get five stars. And I don't want it to get five stars because I want this to be the better match. You know what? We will use that power card, but we'll use it next week. Let's buy it, though. We'll buy it. We'll purchase it. That's us. Got that for next week. Manage rosters. Anything happening? Anybody? Uh, Becky Lynch's popularity soared up to 79. So good for her. Tony Storm's doing it 46. Damn it. She mustn't be doing enough porn. Mustn't, mustn't have enough clothes off. Very low popularity. Uh, everyone else looks no bad. Look at the rivalries. We've got Lynch and Gonzalez and a tag team rivalry with Morgan and Sasha Banks. Brock Lesnar's on a rivalry with Orton. Goldberg's on a rivalry with Joe. This makes a lot more sense now. We've got Damian Priest and a bit of a rivalry with Lashley. Ah, that looks okay then. All right, I get it. I know, I, I know the direction we're heading in, so let's go and head in there now. Let's get into the show. Let's do it. Oh, shit. I forgot about the show logistics. Almost booked it for the high school gym. That would have been an absolute disaster. Let's get to the Thunderdome. The Thunderdome is, as Finney Mac would say, uh, we need all these special lighting effects and all this garbage, all this shit that costs us a shitload of money. We need all this. We need all the best of gear. Right, let's do it. Let's go. Boom. Let's get into the show. Show cost £155,000. That's going to take a lot of money out of our budget, but we're just going to have to settle for it. Uh, you have to speculate to accumulate, and we're speculating a lot of cash here tonight, guys, so do not let us down. Here you go. Final booking for Monday Night Raw. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's go. Let's get into it. Boom. Loading screen is testing my patience. I'm pumped. I'm ready to go, and the loading screen's taking about 10 million years. Right. Bobby Lashley, Damien Priest, who's going to win it? Who's going to come out on top? It's going to be... Bobby Lashley, of course it was going to be Bobby Lashley. Okay, two and a half, is that it? Two and a half, fuck, what? Right, here we go. Porno time. I'm expecting five stars here. We don't get five stars, but we get a good pro, <laughs> fuck me, <laughs> promo rating. <laughs> Jesus Christ. If you change, if you change a couple of letters there, it's almost, I don't know, we'll forget it. I don't want it. I don't want Tony Storm to sue me or anything like that, but it, it does seem awful. It does seem awful porn obsessed there. Right, Montez Ford versus Seth freaking Rollins. Who's going to win this one? Do we really care? Does it change much? Well, Seth Rollins wins, so we'll see. We'll see. A two-star mediocre match. Are you shitting me? Really? Uh, Riddle now is going to call it Seth Rollins. And, ah, uh, so... Oh, don't get this. Seth Rollins having the match with Montez Ford meant his rivalry with Riddle ended? Like, what? Why? 
On what planet? Why? That doesn't even make any sense. Fuck. Right. Here we go, main event time. Let's do this. I'm going to play as... I'm going to play as the old guys. I'm fucking half to. It's Brock Lesnar and Goldberg. 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 Right, here we go. Raw, Monday night. Raw. We're coming at you. These loading screams really do test your patience, man. You're pumped up. You're ready to go. You want to fight. You're almost jumping through the screen. You know, trying to throw fists, but... Then you have to sit down in your arse and, and wait for 10 minutes because the screen's still loading. I guess that's the way the cookie crumbles, but I don't like cookies and I don't like crumbles. I like I like the donuts. Are we getting any donuts tonight? Who knows? Nah, we're getting buffalo wings. I forgot. We're in New York. Here he comes. Here comes the police. Getting a police escort to the ring. And there he is. Goldberg. Freshly get, coming off the arrest. Who knows what he done to get escorted by these four guys. Must be smuggling a lot of cake. Ah, cake. Coke. Coke, damn it. Not the Coca-Cola. No, that stuff. The other stuff. The white powdery stuff. Has this guy been snorting it? Who knows? Got a lot of hair chest there, Goldberg. I think it's time you took a shave, man. But the, the, fire, the, the, light, the sprinklers are going off. The fireworks are going off. He's getting burnt. Look at that. He can't handle it. He's no selling it. What a man. He looks pissed off. He is pissed off. <laughs> he's a, he's a wolf. I guess, man, he's, he's he's raising the fist. He's doing the fake punching. Save the fake punching for the ring, mate. Come on. Right, here we go. Goldberg looks angry enough. Let's skip this. Let's get to his tag team partner. The Beast. Brock Lesnar. I believe he's the champ. I say I believe he's the champ. I know he's the champ. No one's taking that belt on. Even though Joe did hold it for like a picnic, Joe held it for like two minutes. Brock Lesnar quickly won it back. And I don't think Brock Lesnar is going to be giving it away any time soon. Brock's looking awful serious tonight. Probably doesn't want to team up with Bill Goldberg. He's probably pissed off. But we'll see. We'll see if these two guys can get along. Will they get along? Can they get along? Do they even want to get along? Maybe not. Brock's still sporting the ponytail. Walking past Goldberg. I wonder what Goldberg thinks of that ponytail. I wonder if we'll see Goldberg in a ponytail anytime soon. Ponytail on a pole match. That could work. That could do it. Well, let's not I mean, walking all the way around the ring when he could have just done that in the first place. <laughs> I mean, he was there. He, did he really have to do a lap around the ring? I mean, he's brought Lesnar. He can do what he wants. I'm not going to tell him off, but but still, waste that bit of minute, two minutes there, for, for apparently no reason. But here we go, Goldberg and Lesnar waiting on their opponents. And the first opponent is Randy Orton. And uh, we're going to go ahead and skip. Randy Orton, because we make the rules. We don't want to see our opponents come to the ring. The quicker they get in the ring, quicker we can kick their ass, right? So that's why we're that's why we're doing a wee skip here. Let's go. Flashing lights. That can only mean one thing. This, the Buffalo eating, the Buffalo wing eating machine, Samoa Joe. Down, 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 down. Here he comes. Apparently, Joe doesn't wash his trunks. And just looking at them, like I mean. I wouldn't say that's a rumor. It could be an it could be an actual fact. But uh, here we go. We're gonna we're gonna whitewash them tonight. Let's do this. Oh, spinning kick for Goldberg takes down Orton. He may, he may be 52 years old or whatever age he is, but Big Bill can can still move. Bill Goldberg with the going for the kick there. Orton grabs him by the fit and, <laughs> and slams him face first there. Orton then we are running knee to the dome. No hair there to protect Goldberg's dome. From that knee, Orton now calling for something. Screen just froze. What the hell? Goldberg's dragging him in by the head. <laughs> a clubbing blow to the back. I don't think Orton was expecting that. Goldberg goes for a storm. Oh, and a spin buster for Big Bill. Wow. Orton just ran straight into that. Orton did not have a clue what happened there. Big drop kick though from Randy. Tagging in the fat man. Samoa Joe. The only guy morbidly obese in this match. I wonder if he feels left out. 
Goldberg there tasting, not tasting the buffalo wings, he's tasting the turnbuckle. He's fighting back, he gets Joe into the corner. <laughs> oh, he, now he eats a knee for Joe. Goldberg's getting all the food that he doesn't want here. It's, it's Samoa Joe that wants the food. It's the wrong guy fucking eating. Samoa Joe now, got oh, big head butt. The Goldberg in the corner, Goldberg trying to hang on, but they don't avail. He just gets dragged into the centre of the ring and now it's Samoa Joe and Goldberg here, maybe looking for a tag. Samoa Joe, top rope. Don't like to see this guy in the top. Could be dangerous, but Goldberg where it strikes as he tries to get his way back into this. Irish whip into the corner on a running knee. Bill hits a running knee on Samoa Joe. And now Samoa Joe could be a bit to get acquaintance to an old friend. The tag gets made to Brock Lesnar and here comes Lesnar. Lesnar destroying Samoa Joe here. Lesnar on top of Joe, Lesnar beating the shit out of Joe. Joe can't handle it, Joe wants none of it. Lesnar now has got Joe up, what's he going for here? Suplex perhaps, yes, slams him. It's more Joe in the middle of the ring, stunned. Brock Lesnar now looking as if he's going to pick him apart, he climbs on top. Mere ground and pound. Is this MMA or what? Samoa Joe's getting absolutely de destroyed here. And Bill is going to get tagged back in, but looks like Joe's going to try and make the tag to Orton, and he does make the tag, and <laughs> lucky ducky there, Joe, but Bill, Bill's back in, <laughs> and Bill with a top kick to Randall. Oh, Bill hitting moves that he used to hit when he was like 26 and in his prime, not when he was 52 indeed, but still, what's he going for here? Goldberg, he's got Orton up, S slams him down. Orton in a bit of trouble here. In a, a bit of trouble. Fuck, he's in a lot of trouble. Goldberg, he's gone by the throat. Just lifts him into the air. Oh, <laughs> and fucking drops him. Oh, man. And I think Randy Orton's time could be up here. It could be all over. Oh, no, I went for the spear. Totally missed it. Bill goes for a drop kick again. Orton goes to the knee. Goldberg's old knees can't live up to this. And he gets dropped on his head. Lesnar wants tagged in. The Brock wants back in. Brock demanding a tag. But we're not getting it. We're getting dragged to the other side of the... Oh, big elbow. That's what we need it. Went for it. Didn't happen. Orton with the DDT. Orton slowing the pace down. Orton hitting the rewind button. Slow motion button. There's not a lot we can do. We're getting our carcass <laughs> dragged into the middle here. Orton, is he about to put Bill Goldberg away here? He's stomping away, picking away like a hyena. His opponent, a hyena that is picking away at something that was left in the... <laughs> left in the... Holy shit! Talking shite and I almost got beat there. Jesus, right. At least Brock came in to save the day. <laughs> Where's Randy Orton going with Brock Lesnar? What the fuck? Brock Lesnar just got tossed onto the... the oh, and Bill Goldberg with a massive spear. What was that? What the hell was that? Orton is trying to get back up here, but but oh, Bill Goldberg's like, no. Bill Goldberg's like, you're not going anywhere, and it could be Jack Hammer time. I think Orton could be... Oh, he counters it! What the fuck? Orton with a big German suplex. Out of nowhere. What a counter for Randy Orton. But Goldberg's back on his feet. Goldberg refusing to stay down long. Big clothesline on Randy. And a big drop kick. And now he's setting it up. It could be all over here. Samoa Joe ducks underneath. Samoa Joe avoiding. Sure disaster. Goldberg fights back. We have massive chop of his own. Goldberg working the arm now, but Joe fights his way out of it. Goldberg rolls through. Goldberg misses a drop kick. These guys are countering everything. And oh, and Goldberg is planted on that bad neck. And Joe just jumps on the arm. But Goldberg again rolls through. Goldberg with a clothesline. Goldberg, another spear. Or whatever you want to call it. Goldberg here could have tagged it. <laughs> but he goes for another spear. And Goldberg is gotten by the throat again. Holy shit, this time he's lifting Joe up. <laughs> and then he plants him right. Can we kill him this time? Can we put him away? 
Hold on a second. I need to figure out how you do. How do you do? How do you do Goldberg's other submission spear? Okay, ring only. So spear corner versus grounded opponent. So the spear's not even his finisher, right? Now I know where I was fucking up. At least I know what his finisher is now, Jackhammer. Now let's just go for it. Goldberg looks angry. But I think you'll be happy in a minute, because this match is about to be over. <sighs> Smashes him in the middle of the ring, drops him on his back. Brock Lesnar comes in. Come oh, on, Joe, are you shitting me? Joe actually kicked out. Samoa Joe kicked out. Let's just do it again. I mean, he kicked out of one, he's not going to kick out of a second. We've got Randy Orton and Brock still battling away. Goldberg doesn't care, though. Goldberg doesn't give a shit. He's got some Ojo up and some Ojo counters it though. We need to the face. And now Joe has got Bill up. And Bill gets dropped onto the turnbuckle. He's in the corner now. He's, oh, he's fighting out though. Goldberg got the foot of Joe, just throws Joe halfway across the ring. And now it is Bill looking to finally put his man away. That's a backbreaker. Brock Lesnar's getting back in there. Brock Lesnar looks pissed. Maybe we should make a tag to Brock Lesnar. Does Lesnar want it? If Lesnar wants it, he can get it. Lesnar now coming into the ring. <laughs> Lesnar going for German suplexes. And there's not a lot Joe can do. Apart from just sit there and hold on. <laughs> and pray that he doesn't die. His fat ass gets dropped and Lesnar is now carrying Joe towards the middle of the ring. And I think we're going to make sure Orton doesn't do anything but the referee doesn't let us get in. And new Randy Orton's... Oh, and Randy Orton's allowed in, but we weren't. What's this all about? Randy Orton's paying for it now, though. He's getting absolutely barred. Joe ducks the roundhouse kick. Brock just knees Orton in the corner. Bill Goldberg takes a big boot to the face. And Goldberg's done. Goldberg rolls to the outside. Joe attacks Brock from behind. And what's Joe setting up for here? Could be muscle buster time or not. There's not a lot we can do. I mean, Joe's about to connect. We're on the outside. We're fucked. We can't help him. Brock Lesnar's down. Joe goes for the cover. Could be over too, and Brock says no. Brock's like, damn it, I'm not getting beat. I'm not losing to Fat Man. But Joe, <laughs> I don't know what they even call that. He just lifts him up, slams him down, tags in Randy Orton. And Randy Orton could be moments away here by putting away Brock Lesnar. He's got him up. Brock Lesnar counters it. Brock Lesnar's got Randy up there. Where's he going with him? He just throws him out the ring. Like a rag doll. Like a piece of meat. If it was a piece of meat, some more Joe wouldn't have thrown him out the ring. He'd have put it in his mouth, but oh, he just tosses him into the steel steps, right? Let's go and take care of Joe here. If we if we eliminate Joe, then I'm sure Brock can beat Randy, but I mean we can't have some more Joe continuously coming in and interrupting count. So here we go, we're just gonna batter his fat ass on the outside. Just keep tossing him into this uh announce table. Brock then with a Got an arm bar in on the outside. Samoa Joe gets slammed into the ring. And oh, Bill could be looking for the spear. Bill Goldberg, turn around, fatty. Boom, he can exit. Damn, it could be over. Yeah, no guy, Samoa Joe knows he's done. And here we go. Let's see, can we get Randy Orton back in here? Come on, Randy, let's do it. Get in the ring. Let's go. But these two is too busy battling on the outside. Samoa so Joe's still down. I mean, Orton's propping himself up against the the barricade. And he gets his head busted in there. So here we go. Let's get him back in the ring. Oh, and into the steel steps. For some reason, we just cannot get these two back in the ring. I think Samoa so Joe's about to wake up. So let's go and pay him a wee visit. Right, Samoa Joe, my best friend. We meet again. <laughs> oh, he's trying to run away from us. Look at this. Samoa Joe doesn't want done. He doesn't want any of Goldberg. And now he's... Oh, no. We don't want none of him. He's gone. What the fuck's he doing to our legs? He's just snapped our legs in half. 
What the hell did Samoa Joe just do to Goldberg there? <laughs> We're down and out. We are down and out. Orton and uh, Brock still fighting on the outside. Randy Orton gets in the ring. Calls for Brock to get in. Brock now climbs in. And Randy tags in Samoa Joe. Right, let's see, can we get back in? Can we call for a tag? Referee says, no, you're not allowed in. Alright, okay, I'll just have to wait here then. I'll wait patiently. And Joe, not again. Joe just throwing Brock to the outside here. That's not on. We're trying to get in, but the referee telling us we're not allowed. Right, Brock, come on, tag me in. He's got the submission! Oh no, but Joe counters it again. This time Joe tosses to the side and Joe breaks up the cover again. Fuck. Brock now has got some more Joe up. Oh no, Joe counters. Joe goes for the leg. Brock gets taken down. It's two on one. Brock's on his own. Although Brock getting to his feet first here. Randy must be hurt. Randy's still down. Brock's lifting him up. Brock's about to put him away with F5, it looks like, maybe not. Head first into the into the turnbuckle. Let's see, can we get a tag now? Oh no, Morton just hit an RKO. We're fucked. I don't think Brock's kicking out of that. I don't think Brock's kicking out of that. So we're going to have to come in and save him. Yes, we are going to save him, Morton. Oh fuck, Morton with a clothesline in the corner. But Goldberg counters it. No, he doesn't. He doesn't. He gets stomped away. Goldberg is down. Brock's getting back to his feet. Samoa Joe's tagged back in. But Brock keep, takes Joe down. He's got him in the Kimura. He's got the arm bar. But Orton again with the counter. Fuck. Ah, so close, but so far. Brock going for the F5, it looks like. He plants him. Surely that's it. That, that's surely it. No, a rope break. Too close to the fucking ropes. Are you shitting me? What did we have to do to win this here? We just cannot seem to win this match. Samoa Joe. Samoa Joe. <laughs> what was that? I don't know what it was, but Brock Lesnar hits a massive DDT. Will that be enough to put Joe away? I don't know. He's not going for the cover. He's too busy. He's continuing to kick his ass. And <laughs> I'm running power slam right. On Brock. Go for the pin here. Go for the pin. Where's he dragging him to? What's Brock doing? Dragging him into the centre of the ring. Now he goes for the cover. But Orton's in again and Orton makes... Wait, we need to get rid of Orton here. We need to take care of Andy Orton. Brock's pissed off. Brock wants Orton. Some more Joe counters. Some more Joe now taking care of Goldberg. Goldberg, they're going to try and hit the jackhammer on Samoa Joe. But Brock doesn't even allow us to. Brock just breaks it up. What the fuck was that? <laughs> now Brock striking away at Joe here. Obviously Brock didn't want our help. And now Joe's on the outside. No, we need to get this back in the inside, Brock. What are you doing? Brock's a fucking animal. What's he no, Brock, get in the, get in the ring. Under the take him out. Go for it now. Defeat him. I can I can take care of um, Orton here. You can take care of Joe. Teamwork makes the dream work, but Orton with a counter. Orton, neck breaker. Brock Lesnar's got a cover. One, two. Finally we get the win. Randy Orton was too busy kicking our ass on the outside. Didn't see... The Brock had a cover. Brock gets the free count. Goldberg and Brock celebrate. It took a lot longer to win that match than I thought it would, but they look happy. Am I happy though? I don't know. We'll look at the rating, we'll find out what the show did, and then we'll see what we've got in store for the next couple of weeks. But uh, I mean, hopefully that show delivered. I thought it was pretty good. Three and a half star main event. I would have liked a wee bit better. Probably would have liked four stars, but we'll see. We'll see. Let's hopefully, compared to. Smackdown, I'm hoping it did pretty well. We'll see what they did. 
Let's have a look at what they've got. I mean, I've got G. Uso versus some guy that looks like the fucking Predator. And the Predator wins, so... How's that getting three and a half? Honestly, you tell me. Mandy Rose up next. Okay, promo. We've got Alexander Wolf and JBL taking on Tyler Bate and Trent Seven. Uh, who's winning this one? Trent Seven and Tyler Bate. Two and a half stars. Roderick Strong calling it Cena. And in the main event, Women's Championship match on the line. Extreme Rules. Shayna Baszler wins. Smackdown pick up a big win there. Four stars. I'm going to assume the beat is again. They had a better opener. They had a better mid card. And they had a better main event. So when you do the maths, it spells disaster for us. And yeah, we gained 23,000 fans. What did Smackdown gain? Smackdown gained 31,000. Okay, so we didn't lose by that much. But still a loss nonetheless. Smackdown now pull further away. Uh, of us in this race to I don't even know what we're racing to but the goal is to get more fans and at the moment we don't have more uh, we've got less fans, we've got less money we need to start changing things around next week is going to be I mean, no, we're going to go for it next week we're going to put on we're going to go all out to try and put on one of the best shows we can Bobby Lashley, hey my contract is up at Raw at the end of the week we need to keep Bobby Lashley I'd be interested in staying ok I can do that Bobby no problemo consider yourself Signed for another five weeks or however much that money is buying me. Goldberg's contract's up at the end of the week. Uh, okay, you can have that. 36k, that is absolutely no problem. We will take that 36k and we'll put it into your bank account. Uh, just a quick reminder, your friends want to see great matches. Okay, Triple H, thanks for the irrelevant information that we already knew. Uh, Randy Orton, good old St. Louis, tend to give my adoring fans what they want. I'd be better on the card tonight, or they'll be held to pace, Sonia. Okay. Uh, Montez Ford, hey, I feel like I'm the fall guy every week at the moment. Whatever your next match is, I want to win. Well, I mean, if you can't get the job done, mate, that's not my fault. I mean, that, that is definitely not my fault. Uh, fix match. We can fix the match. We could fix a match for Montez Ford to win. So, I mean, we'll tell you what. We will buy this fix match thing, and that could come in handy down the line in the journal. Uh, ensure that Tony Storm cuts a promo this week. Triple H wants Tony Storm to cut a promo. She cut a promo last week. So he must like things in Tony Storm's hand, essentially. Montez Ford just demanded that he wins his next match. So we've got a lot of stuff, guys, to take care of in the next episode. But that's do it for now. We'll be back next time. Hopefully we can put on a better show. Hopefully we can defeat SmackDown for the first time in the ratings in, like, almost, what, four or five weeks? And, uh, yeah, I mean, we're getting close to, like, the halfway stage now of this series. And we do need to start clawing in the gap. They're over... What, about 123,000 fans ahead of us? I mean, yeah, we can still win. It's not that much, but we can't really afford to let it get any bigger, guys. The gap needs to come down. Anyway, I've been Scott Scotland 8. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment down below. I'll catch you in the next one. And until then, peace.